Everybody, it's Bo here from Paint Barn Creations. Today I'm going to be showing you how to clean the Laser X2S1 40 watt. Hope you enjoyed the video. Let's get to it. Okay, here we go. I'm going to clean this Laser module head and the fans. See how dirty they are. When you get your X2, you get this little case with it. And it comes with, get this off of here. This little hex head screwdriver. Then it's gonna go in these screws right here. But first, you wanna take this off right here and just pull it up, take it off. I'm gonna push this back a little bit. This one, take the screws out. Kind of pull back on a little bit and pull it out. Then we're gonna undo these hoses. See how nasty this thing gets. I gotta clean it up. Gotta wipe all this down, take this off, take this off, take this top off. There's two fans in here. That's gotta be cleaned. And we're gonna go over that right now. All right, what we're gonna do is take these screws out. So we can get to the fans. the same allen wrench to get the fans out sorry about the noise in the background got the washer and dryer going it's all good there goes one of my screws I'll get it here in a minute being a bugger getting out of there sometimes you get screws like it there we go then you just pull it out like this right here it's filthy what we're going to do is take one of these and some cleaning solution we're going to dip it on here and wipe the fans down and then we're going to dip the solution or dip this q-tip in solution and go in between the blades of the fan right here make sure we get it real good Get this in here. And just kind of go around like this. Hopefully you can see this. Around and around. Alright. See how black that is? Still the other side. Right. 
filthy. All right, what we do? I'm gonna put a little bit on this right here. Put a little bit on a little splash on that. And we just kind of dab this on here. See that? Then use the other right side to dry it off. Get that like that. You take this case, kind of wipe it on here too. See how filthy that is. Take a clean one and dry it off. That's a lot better to do this side. There we go. You got that good to go. Alright, I'm gonna take this put this fan back together and I'm gonna take the other fan off and do the same thing. See the difference in the fans? That one's real clean, the other one's still dirty. Right now once all the fans are clean and this top piece is clean we want to put this back on actually it goes this way make sure the hose are facing the back of the module put these screws back in then we'll go to the next step right here because it's so filthy I know this lifts up right here Oh, it just lifts up. Okay. Take this off. This. Okay. Take one inch drive cloths. Kind of go over it. solution on it and take the dry end dry it off take another wipe hose back up slide right on slide this over 
the eye here. Goes down this way. And we'll wipe this off. Dry it off for the dry cloth. The cloth I'm using is the 4 Pro lint free cotton wax. Comes with 240 in the box. Just like that, voila. Now I'll take a wipe. Get off the smudges on the front, the sides, back. Turn it off. Okay. I still got the tape on there. I'm gonna go ahead and take it off. There we go. Voila. Before I mount this back right here, you see how dusty that is? I'm gonna clean that up. And then we're going to reinstall the module. All right, here we go. It's dark in my machine because I got the power off right now while I'm working on it. That's what I recommend you do too. This goes right in here. See the two screw holes right here in the front. That's what these two holes go right here. All right. Kind of lift it up kind of sits back like this and then flops right over. this right here to the only slot that's left and then we put this back right here and it's magnetic and there it is now you're ready to power on voila all right there you have it if you enjoyed this video give it a like comment and subscribe to the channel we'd love to have you appreciate you thanks for watching the video